Hey, Scott Smith here with Al's Trailer Sales. Uh, normally we're at uh, 4843 Portland Road Northeast, but uh, this weekend, right now, at the State Fairgrounds. So, this is the Spring RV Show, and uh, we brought a lot of inventory here. We've got uh, a lot of stuff. I'm going to turn this camera around, and let's take a look and see what all we've got. So, we've got the uh, FR3 motorhome these are uh, by Forest Hoover these are really really nice units uh, very comfortable class A's and we got some folks in there so we'll stay out of that one but then we've got the uh, pursuits by coachman they are really really nice and comfortable class A's let's take a look inside here all right so inside this is a Ford powered unit there all right, so take a look at that woodwork. This is very nice wood. And take a look at those joints there. See, this is not just paper over wood. This is really, really fine woodwork. Just beautifully finished. Feels like one of those uh, old-style Chris Craft boats. So really, really comfortable units here. So this is the uh, Pursuit by Coachman. Nice, very nice unit. So this is one of the many... You know, so we brought out here. Excuse me. And we've got the Mini Winnies. The Mini Winnies are really nice. These now are uh, program vehicles. So they were uh, rentals, uh, mainly for uh, European visitors who came, wanted to tour the States. Um, they'll bring a lot of pots and pans with them. So these are completely reconditioned, refurbished. You would not know that this is a used unit, but for the price, really good on these. So the Mini Winnies, these are the Class C's. We've got a number of these here at the show with us. And uh, you can just kind of see there's a lot of those Mini Winnies here. We've got the, the Coachman's, and then of course we've got travel trailers, fifth wheels. We've got those here at the fairgrounds, state fairgrounds. The show is going on right now. It's a beautiful day. Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. We're going to be here. We're going to take a walk around, take a look at what we have here. A lot of the grand designs. Grand designs are hard to find, very popular. So we've got the reflection in the fifth wheel, as well as the travel trailer. These are very comfortable, very nicely appointed, beautiful grand designs. Great story there. I encourage you to take a look online at their uh, at the Grand Designs RV website. So you take a look at that nice island, beautiful furniture. This is truly a rolling vacation home. This is the uh, reflection by Grand Designs. These fireplaces do put out nice heat. So when you're stopped and you're uh, plugged into the electricity, you're not burning pro your propane very very comfortable so that's the reflection travel trailer we do have that in the fifth wheel as well let's take a look chalet these are really nice you can put this fold it flat in about a minute and put that right in your garage you can wheel it around this is uh, some very 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 good pricing on a chalet you know don't want to pass that up so here's the imagine this is also by grand designs Let's take a look inside here. So this one has the kitchen in the rear. Nice refrigerator. This has the pop-up television fireplace. Theater style seating. Very comfortable. The pass-through bath, which my wife really likes because she says hallways are just a waste of space. So she likes that pass-through. Now these passports are really nice. These are uh, great units. Uh, this is the uh, 239. And this one, so if you look at that seating right there, so that is a jackknife sofa, and right behind it folds down a Murphy bed. So you have a lot of space when you don't need it. I mean, when you don't need the bed, but you do have the space when you do need it. The uh, dinette, of course, that folds down into a bed. You have back here 
the bathroom, but also these bunks. And some people say, well, you know what, I, I don't have the kids to put back there. But if you have dogs, that's a great place for the dogs. And you've got a ton of very accessible storage in any kind of a bunkhouse. So these are really, really helpful, really nice units. So we do have some more mansions back here and the passports. I encourage you to come down to the state fairgrounds, Al's trailers. There's another one of the passports, the Aerolites. Now, these are also a Dutchman product. Really nice, very comfortable units. You've got the uh, queen bed here. And then coming in, you've got rear living. Uh, now, a lot of people really like the rear living ones. Look at the size of the window back here. Now, one of the beautiful things about this is that window with the rear living, theater seating, dinette set. When you get into uh, many of the RV parks, the, you'll back into your spot, and that's going to have the view. A lot of them will be by the river, have a nice mountain view. So when you get into the RV park, these rear living with the windows are really nice because you back up, and that's where the view is. So you can enjoy that. So we've got... Coleman's and Springdale's. Now these are some really nice trail. I like Springdale's because they have very big windows. So let's get in. Now this is a very nice unit. So you got the dinette. That table folds down so the uh, uh, you can use that as a, as a bed when you fold that into the dinette area. That table is not attached so it'll fold down. It can become a coffee table. You can take it outside. Uh, you can use it. This, this is a this is a very, very nice travel trailer. It's very family friendly. This one also has the jackknife sofa with the Murphy bed. Nice kitchen, plenty of counter space. I like the I like the Springdales. They're some of my favorite favorite trails trailers here at Al's Trailer Sales. We are normally on Portland Road right at the end of Lancaster, but today we are at the state fairgrounds. This is another Springdale. We're gonna be here today, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Big windows. Now this is the uh, bunkhouse model again. Bunkhouses are very popular. Um, bunkhouses are interesting. One of the things I found is, is that uh, many bunkhouses don't get traded in, so finding used ones is more of a challenge. Uh, they don't get traded in, they get handed down. So as grandma and grandpa uh, move on to uh, a different unit, they'll often uh, just uh, pass the uh, bunkhouse on. So here we are. Take a look at this. This is another Aerolite Dutchman. Really nice opening. Very comfortable. So a very big slide with the dinette and the sofa there. And then you've got the separate room with the queen bed, little closet storage there, windows. You've got power outlets, storage. The um, layout's really comfortable on that. So we've got the Springdale's, Coleman's. Those are great entry level. Uh, passports are very comfortable travel trailers. Now I wanna just show you a picture of this one over here. Hey Clyde. This is Grand Lodge, take a look at that. This is what they call a um, destination trailer or park model trailer. Now way back when Al Torno started this dealership, uh, Al's Trailers, uh, he had just come back from Vietnam. And he started selling uh, trailers to, to live in. And uh, today we call them manufactured homes. But they, uh, he started selling those. That's where the whole business got started. Then he got into the uh, RV side of the business. And then uh, a couple of years ago, he and his wife Bonnie were able to retire. And uh, the business transferred to another family. And um, so it was sold that time. And uh, just a wonderful history to the dealership here. Let's take a look at this uh, Denali. The Denalis are very nice. Very well built, also a Dutchman product. You can see we've got some uh, really good pricing on these. So this 
Denali. One of the great things about these is even though it's a pull behind, a bumper pull as they call it, a traditional travel trailer, because it has this domed ceiling, this arch in the ceiling, there's a lot of headroom and it feels very comfortable, which makes it feel bigger. <laughs> nice furniture, nice finishings on this one. Again, you have the pop-up television and the fireplace, the electric fireplace. Puts out good heat. We're going to need it today. This is a beautiful weather. I encourage you to come down to the state fairgrounds today, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. And come and see Al's trailers. We brought a lot of our inventory from the lot here. So we've got fifth wheels, travel trailers, Class C and Class A motorhomes. Fifth wheels and toy haulers. Now the sandstorms are very popular. Let's go in through. This has got the two entries. So you got the pass through bath into the kitchen. Bunk. And then the uh, back end opens there. You can store a lot of stuff. The furniture here folds up, pushes in. You can store some pretty good toys back here. The toy rollers are very popular, even for people that don't have toys. Uh, notice this one here. This is the momentum. The back, you can bring your, your uh, toys in and out of it, but the back folds down and you've got this uh, party deck. Got an awning, got the stairways that come up. It goes into the garage. You can see you got the, the bunks here. These are power motored bunks that go up and down. This model also has a washer dryer hookup. Check that out. And second half bath here. And then the main living area. Beautiful theater seating. Nice kitchen. Very nicely appointed. Quad fridge. Nice entertainment center. And again, a fireplace. So the... Um, the fifth wheels in uh, in the uh, momentum toy haulers very comfortable so everyone's happy with these they're really nice go back out through the garage again here and so the momentums are very popular this is coleman so the back end is open here you can go in and see you've got great storage space for your toys You've got the second, the separate room for the bedroom. And then the living area in here. This is a really nice unit. This is, this is a beautiful deal on a toy hauler. You want to come down to the fairgrounds and uh, see us. Now we do have all of the inventory online, but we brought so much of it here. You want to take a look now. This, the Momentum, again, that's a beautiful toy hauler. That's got the two party decks, lots of room to store on that. And then, now let's take a look over here. This is a, this is a very interesting toy hauler. So, let's go in. All right, so this is the fifth wheel. Got a nice, nice bathroom, very comfortable here. Bedroom. This is a toy hauler, so we've got the uh, nice fireplace, living room in the garage back in here. And once again, you've got another half bath. So for a toy hauler, this is, again, the rolling vacation home. These are just beautiful, really beautiful units. And there's uh, one I want to show you here. This is really nice. Little demo on the uh, perfect for say a motorcycle, a quad, a golf mm -hmm. cart. I mean, it's all enclosed, and then you've got all your living space still. Mm -hmm. Yeah, fabulous. So, this has that garage in the back that uh, we're just taking a look at now. When you get inside, this one for a toy hauler has a nice feature too. And that is this front living room. 
big television that pops down. And you've got seating all the way around here in the front living. So a tow hauler with front living overlooking a grand kitchen island here. Very nice. Then you have back into the bedroom and we were just looking outside so right below that is the toy storage. So if you have a, uh, a motorcycle, you've got uh, a quad or a couple of smaller quads, you can put that right in there. This is a really nice unit. Come down to the state fairgrounds, see us house trailers. We brought lots of inventory, something for everybody. We've got the Wolf Pups, the 17FQ, very, very popular travel trailer. We've got the Momentum Toy Haulers. We've got the Solitude. Those are uh, home replacements. Those are uh, Grand Designs, fifth wheels. Really, really nice. We've got plenty of inventory out here. Now, on the inside, we have even more inventory. So the best thing to do is to come down to the State Fairgrounds today, Saturday. <laughs> excuse me, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Let's go inside. So you can see Al's here. We've got lots of inventory ready. We are ready to uh, take you on the grand tour. This is the Solitude Toy Hauler. Now we were just looking at the momentum. And so it has the garage in the back as well as uh, some beautiful appointed living on the front. You've got an outdoor kitchen, entertainment center, pass-through storage, and the front living. So hey, this is Scott Smith at Al's Trailers at the State Fairgrounds. Please come on down and see us Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Uh, I encourage you to not wait. Um, deals are happening. And uh, if you find the unit that you want, well, make the deal on it now. Because uh, once someone else buys it, well, you don't have the opportunity. So today is the day, Thursday. Friday, Saturday, Sunday at the State Fairgrounds, Al's Trailers. I'm Scott Smith. Have a fabulous day. Cheers.